come in on this uh, Vijay Sardana. Particularly, I'm looking at this paragraph uh, in, in, in this affidavit, the Son affidavit, which is of great concern to India, I would say, Vijay Sardana. As an economist, would you say that this is about targeting the India story? Because, you know, one thing which is becoming clear is that she thought that the only way to attack Sri Modi is by attacking Sri Gautam Adani and his group as both are contemporaries and they belong to the same state of Gujarat. See, this uh, affidavit which has come now from Mr. Darshan uh, Hiranandani, it is extremely dangerous and it is not just now Mahua Moitra, but it opens up almost another nine entities which needs to be probed. What you are saying is definitely important because who are these nine entities? Let's be very clear. If you look into the affidavit which you are reading, I will say that paragraph number 11 and 12, the names are mentioned there. Hmm, 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 hmm. Okay. Mr. Gandhi, uh, Mr. Sashi Tarur, Pinaki Mishra, Sucheta Dalal, Shardul Shroff, Pallavi Shroff, then representative of Financial Times, representative of New York Times and BBC. They all are named. There may be many more which may be named or will may emerge later on. Now look at the thing that this citizen who is writing affidavit is a right, right now citizen or I will say the resident of Dubai. He is based outside India. Then he is interacting with some of the well-known people in India. Now, let me for the audience, hmm. uh, if you give me a minute, let me explain. Yes. Mr. Rahul Gandhi, leader of opposition technically, he is the most vocal voice or the face of opposition parties or political system in India. Mr. Sashi Tarur, another well-known person with global international contacts. Mr. Pinaki Mishra, a well-known lawyer and a politician from Odisha. Sucheta Dalal. Frequently writes on financial matters, economic matters, government policy related to investments and related to business aspects. Well-known person in the business means she is influencer. Whatever she will write, people will take seriously. Then you have three people, Mr. Gandhi, Mr. Tarur and Mr. Pinaki Mishra. They will make noise inside parliament and which will be covered by the global media. So this is a well-designed let me put a word in the absence of anything else, a conspiracy against India's interest. All right. Otherwise, what is the focus? Hmm. Focus is not business per se. Focus is to target the Prime Minister of India because when you are going into reforms of the development of India, definitely few business interests will suffer. Few will gain. This is a normal process in any policy making. 